welcome back to the Dumpling Sisters Kitchen. Today, Julie and I are making cashew nut chicken. Now, this one is definitely a takeaway favorite, but we also think that it's super easy to make at home, and our version is delicious. So, as always, let's get started. So before we get cooking, we're going to do a couple of prep things that are going to make the whole process much quicker. First up, we're going to marinate our chicken. So here I've got some lovely chunks of chicken breast, which will be so lovely and juicy when we cook them. To that, we're going to add some bicarb. So we just want about half a teaspoon of that. And this is going to make the meat really tender. And to that we're going to add some corn flour as well. This is the second of what we call the magic ingredients in the Chinese kitchen. This is going to give us a really velvety mouthfeel. For flavouring at this stage, we're going to use just some light soy sauce. So a wee dash of that. What we're doing here is actually just a really simplified version of a classic Cantonese style marinade. We actually did a bit more of an in-depth video on that, so if you want info on that, just click on the eye up here. And now to make up the sauce that's going to coat every piece of chicken and veg. So, oyster sauce. Now what we're putting this into is uh, some water already, so just to loosen up our sauce. So, oyster sauce, and it goes. And to that we are going to add some rice wine, followed by some ground white pepper. Now with all the prep done, we're ready to hit the wok. So get it fired up over a really high heat, and we're just going to start off with some vegetable oil. Okay, give it a good swirl. I can see the oil smoking, so now it's really, really hot. Now. So in goes some diced ginger, along with some onions. So that's getting all the aromatics in there first to kind of really get the flavors to burst and flavor the oil. Okay, now the ginger smells amazing. It's time to put in the rest of the veggies. So we're using some peppers, three different colors. It's up to you what you want to use. And they go. And some lovely mushrooms, all cut to about the same size. So to help things along, I'm going to add a dash of water to create some steam. Everything is just about cooked now. It's going to get cooked again, so it doesn't need to be fully cooked. So into the plate it goes. Okay, the wok is back on a really high heat, and when it's red hot, I'm going to put in some oil, so I can see the smoke coming off now. There we go. Let's get it swirl. And we just want to seal this chicken, have it hit a really hot wok, and have it like form a lovely crust immediately. So here we go. Spread that out. Oh, lovely. So for more great chicken recipes, we have loads on this channel. Just check out our chicken playlist up here. Chicken playlist? <laughs> and also, if you're not a subscriber already, we'd love to have you join us. Just if you click on the watermark down here, and it'll take you to the subscribe button. And that way you can keep up all the videos we have every single week. These are lovely and brown now, so in go the vegetables. And then the sauce that Julie prepared earlier. So with that sauce added, it's going to thicken up because you've got corn flour and chicken as well. So those will intermingle and form like a really nice, light, thickened coating of sauce. So that is done. And it wouldn't be cashew nut chicken without some cashews, of course. So we like to maximize the crunchiness of these nuts. So we tend not to cook them with the cashew nut chicken itself, but we love to sprinkle them on top. But of course, if you prefer, you can always have it throughout the chicken too. These are just salted roasted cashews we got from the supermarket, which means you don't have to fry them off yourself at home. Easy as. So there it is, guys. This is a classic Cantonese style dish done the Dumpling Sisters way. Of course. It is cashew nut chicken. Or chicken cashew nut. 
It varies on takeaway menus. It does. It? It sometimes it's just chicken with cashew nuts. Mm. But it's never cashew nuts with chicken. Oh, so I'm not sure about that. It probably is. Around. Who mm. knows? I'm just gonna go straight in for a big juicy mm, little chicken. Me too. Mm. And I love how this just has a really light glaze, so it's not mm. like a claggy, mm. overly starchy type sauce. Mm. It's more just like a lovely little, you can kind of see, it's like a lovely little shiny glaze. <laughs> Is that yummy? Mm, it's really good. And although it's chicken uh, breast, it's not actually dry at all. Because like, mm. the way we marinated it with the bicarbonate soda, it has to plump everything up and tenderize it as well. So. It's always kind of got a bouncy texture. Mm. So don't worry about dry chicken breast that you might have had in the past. This is completely different. Mm. So, as always, thank you very much for watching. And um, we'd love to have you subscribers if you're not already. So join us and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye!